Hey, get up. Ugh, I'm itchy. Well, you Damn, I'll be the itching barn, too. Little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <gasps> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh not <laughs> daddy. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're gonna no offense. There's a tractor and everything. We better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Uh, Duck, uh, what are your parents' name? The kid, Duck, uh, Duck. okay. Yeah, nothing bothers Duck. him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? That's a valuable trait lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. <laughs> That's right. He makes up for it with enthusiasm. <laughs> The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Damn straight. I'll ask the girl. Uh, sure, we'll tag along. I'll ask see her. what the girl would like. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I That's understand. Right. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. Man, let me drive that fucking thing, man! I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. <laughs> she kind of looks like a zombie. All right, all right, so we can walk around. But all right, what's going on, you guys? Welcome back to some more Walking Dead. It's been a while since I played Walking Dead, but we are on like part one. I think it was like a new day or something like that. But I am back and playing this it's game. Not Let's the talk most to this guy real quick. Pick up in the world, but it gets the job done. Okay, be sure uh, to check with everyone you've met so far. It's actually a piece of shit, but Hall's all right. Hey there, uh, Kenny. Uh, need any help? What's your plan? So what's, what's your plan? family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. Uh, how's your son doing? Exit, need any help? Should we ask him? Fuck help? it. No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Uh, I'm okay. I have no idea. No kids. Uh, I'm okay. I think I've got it handled okay. Damn right. As long as I keep her safe, I think I'm doing all right. With those things out there, maybe. Sure, that's enough. But you got to ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. I'll keep that in mind. Uh, how's your son doing? We don't, we don't care about his son. We seen how he's doing. All right, so let's go talk to the the wife and Clementine, I guess. Hey there, girls. Oh, you two actually looked relaxed. Uh, what do you do? How's the city? Uh, let's not you talk about that. Actually, look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Ew. Oh, uh, how was that? Fucking it's horrible. Easy. Well, yeah. So, you're good? You get to sleep the whole time, probably. Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? Uh, how's the city? Uh, what do you do? Let's ask about the city's like. How getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just passed people over some just... Just uh, it's okay. It's fine. You don't have to say anymore. Fuck yeah, I'll run I run him over to too. Go home tomorrow. <laughs> but even then I can't take away the things we the things Doc went through. Don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this? Hell no, I was going to jail. <laughs> I was going to jail. Fuck that. Uh who wouldn't Oh shit. Why is there time on that? The last thought I had before seeing any of what happened was of those wrinkly sharpays I see at the clinic. I want to go right back to thinking about that silly dog. 
Oh, all right, so, fuck it. Let's uh, ask her what she does. What do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. Fuck. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Um, uh, no, I used to, uh, what, what, what? Uh, Yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. Alright. So we know that she's a veterinarian. Let's talk to... You having a nice time with Katja Clementine? Katja? Yeah. Alright, that's enough talking with her. So where's the, um... The kid... Oh, <laughs> excuse me. So there's the dumb box of rocks <laughs> and the uh, the other guy. Where's the other? Let's talk to the box of rocks. How you doing, duck? Good. I'm going to drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. You let him talk to you like that? Fuck no. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Hell yeah. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Uh, damn, you gotta do what you gotta do. What was the boy, one of the walkers? You gotta, you gotta do what you gotta what do. You can to survive. Like put a gun to that kid's head and pull the trigger? Fuck that, man. <laughs> he didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh, uh... Damn right. I had to shoot one. I bet it goes up. Yep. Sometimes, it's kill or be killed. I guess. I don't think I'd sleep good after that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? I don't know where my ex-wife is. Uh, my parents are making it with my brother. Oh, shit. Not too close with my family. Oh. Well, they weren't in Atlanta, right? So that's good. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. No problem, man. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Oh my god, where am I going? Alright, so let's go talk to the, uh, pop. What's good, Pop? What you got for me? You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure I follow. How'd you get out of Atlanta? On foot. I was on my way out anyway. I got a ride. I got a ride, and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? Uh, no wife anymore, no family. My parents are making, uh, no, no wife anymore. Wife. Uh, not anymore. Uh, I think she's up in Virginia, maybe. Sorry to hear it. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Uh, I was looking for help in her house. We are getting, uh, I was yeah. just looking for help. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Uh, sure, what is it? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. 
you're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to be in trouble. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Oh, dude, someone's getting <laughs> someone's getting shredded. Go! I'll get my gun. Zombies are getting his ass. Oh! Ducks running his ass over. Reverse that shit. Ouch. Oh, no. Um. Save the kid. And then get him off the tractor. You gotta hit more than that. Come on, back, <laughs> back it up. Please help me, please. Oh shit, yeah, your your fence was doing really good there, bud. Oh, now you're fucked. Now you just gotta turn into mince meat. That's gonna draw a lot of attention. I mean, what else was I supposed to do, you know? I figured if I helped the kid out. Reverse the tractor up. Back that shit up. Oh, he's pissed. He's pissed. Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. I panicked. I'm sorry. I thought I could help them both. Yeah, I thought I could help them both. I thought I could help them both. Look at him. You thought wrong. And now, please, just go. Get out and never come back. So much for a foreman. <laughs> You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Oh, we're out of gas now. Well, this is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. I wouldn't be walking in the middle of the street like that, though. Fuck that. Look. Hey there. You friendly? Trucks run out of gas. No. That's not a person. Fuck. <laughs> I actually thought it was too. Now they're all triggered. Oh shit! What's he doing? Oh hello! Run! Alright, that's enough. Gotta lock that shit. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. Damn, they got the whole set up. Stay shut no matter what. I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell Shelley, is your we have kids. They would have died uh, out there. We're okay. Then we let them. But not dangerous. Just regular folks. What's dangerous is a bunch of people running outside and drawing their attention to us. Lee's right. We're just regular folks, but we actually like helping people. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? Yeah. What is it? I I have to pee. I'd go out there in a minute. In a second. In a minute, Clem. 
Hold that shit in. Kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. She's an asshole. She's a leader. Carly, She's not wrong. She's an asshole. Ran out there. She's an asshole, that's for sure. That's what it takes. Well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. That's right. Fucking call her a bitch, bro. Shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He's not bitten. He wasn't bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We Look at this guy. His fucking face. I want to beat the fuck out of him right now. Over my dead body. We'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no fight. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up. Where's the bite at, fat up. fuck? We gotta throw him out or smash his head in. Kenny, stop it! I'm gonna smash your head what in. What do about this guy? Beat his ass. Dad, <laughs> it's just a boy. It, kick, his ass. kick his ass. That's, <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Everyone, chill the fuck out. Nobody is doing anything. I'm a shut fucking boost a rock. And you shut his the ass. fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fucking matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking oh my God. about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting is he bitten? him. <laughs> oh, I'm upsetting him. It's his son. If it wasn't, uh... alive. Dad, get it. It's a big deal. It's Larry, right? Man, this is his son. Look around, dumbass. I got a daughter in here. You got a daughter in here. Get your head out of your ass, boy. We've all got people in here. We can figure this out without killing anybody. There's another way. Yeah, with a shovel. <laughs> I hate this I'm fucking kill guy. Cat. Just worry about duck. Helicopters Lee. up top. Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when he's just she's a boy. Dead, he'll probably pounce on your little We do what girl. you say, deal with it. She'll uh, turn fast. He's just a boy. And then, there'll be three. He's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. Fuck, I'll let him eat you first. Him out now. Uh, no, stop him. Uh, I'm stopping no, his ass. You don't touch that boy. You don't touch anybody. I've got a little girl I'm trying to protect in here, too. You wanna get violent, you old fuck? Well, That's come right. on. You better have a plan to kill me, though, because it's me before anyone else in here. <laughs> See? You guys had one in there the whole time. Come on, Limb Biscuit, let's go. No one's gonna help. Fuck. That's right. Kick his ass. Kick that ass. Can someone help me? Fuck! You guys don't gotta shoot. You guys got all kinds of shit in this bitch. Man. Who's blasting? You okay? I like that girl. Just great, thanks. <laughs> now they all fucking know. Uh, guys? Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Yeah, ah, bitch. Have your heart attack. Oh, what's wrong with him? Oh, was he bitten? No. I told him to calm down. I did tell him to calm down. I did try to get him to calm down. Can it, asshole? It's his heart. <laughs> My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Hell no, I ain't helping your bitch ass. Pills are. Fuck that. Y'all are fucking rude as fuck. Look. Through the office. We'll do it somehow. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll Fuck keep that guy. My dad. 
Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. Then I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You know your way around town? Damn right. You know your way around? Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Fuck him. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's Fuck right. Fuck that guy. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot. And I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those Damn, we pills. came in this bitch rolling in. Alright, that's what that's what they get. But alright guys, this is gonna be the end of part two of The Walking Dead here today. If you guys enjoyed this video, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe if you guys are new. I post every single day and I'll see you guys later.